All right, this is part two, guys. I have Thursday with my phone. Yeah, my phone only goes for like an hour and eight minutes now, guys. I gotta delete my music. The way I make it. Remember before, my, my videos went for an hour and 25, an hour and 30. Now it's only an hour and 10 minutes. Yeah, so stay tuned tomorrow. I'm gonna vlog at St. Hubert's. After my appointment at the, at the, at the bank. Um, and yeah. Yeah, so people have something calls for all that, obviously. What would be the most interesting one, Ivan? Probably visual effects and cameras. That's going to be an interesting one. Yeah. So the actors will be hungry. Yeah, man. The actors and crewmen are gonna be hungry on set, man. That's why don't don't serve them shitty food. Make sure they get they get served with good food. There's nothing worse working in the middle of nowhere for one year plus one years. You're getting served shitty food. Shitty food means like like spaghetti meat. Spaghetti and meatballs is good, obviously, but get like spaghetti and chili. You know what I'm saying? The um the 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 beef with like with like with like potatoes. That's like shittier food. That's like the food I made in the hospital, right? And then for breakfast, they serve, like, bananas, fruits, and that kind of stuff. And they might maybe give you maybe eggs and maybe bacon and sausage, and that's it. No, like, have, like, your pancakes, your French toast, your sweet beans, your potatoes, your scrambled eggs, your sunny side eggs, or, or suckle eggs, right? They're called suckle eggs. Um, um, you know what I'm saying? Your sausage, your donuts... Strudel. I'm also gonna have strudels too, you know what I'm saying? Strudels are really good. Yeah, I'll have like hey, make apple, strawberry, blueberry strudels and have the cream for it. You can have that with your you know, see, like an amazing breakfast, man. Yeah, man. I'm spoiling the the the, 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 the cats and group. I'm spoiling them, yeah man. That's why everyone's with me so bad, obviously. But see I don't hate these, man. Yeah, I'm not looking at 10, 20 thousand resumes, guys. I don't have time for that. My team can't do that, so sorry. See, if I had a non-film studio, then I would see these people are more than welcome to apply, obviously, but I wouldn't pay them 150k. I'd pay them maybe 60k or something like that. Because everyone wants that 150,000 on the side, because most people in the world don't make that. That's why they want they want that job so bad, obviously. They want that side, obviously. But I told you, if CS people apply, that means my team has to look, are, are going to be looking at like 20, 30, but they don't have time to look at all that. And that's why you, you narrow it, you, you, when you pull out the ads, it goes to the Hollywood unions. For, I'll just say, I need Lord of the Rings and Hobbit crew to work on my movie, and they all sign up. Yeah, and it goes out to the Hollywood unions. I only want Hollywood actors. I don't want to see his actors. I'm sorry. Yeah. You'll be shopping for a company. All right, but this is your company? Holy shit, you have a high-end jet. Peter owns a jet, but not the kind of jet I own, right? Peter owns, like, I don't know, maybe a 60 million dollar jet. I own my 300 million dollar jet. And, like, I pimped it out, like, incredible. And so when he flies on my jet, he's like, holy shit, how are you going to He sees my nice studio a lot, my grandma's studio a lot. Holy shit. Your, your studio lot's nice. Yeah, man. It's nice, man. Hollywood acts are all shocked. When they see the, the trailers of the documentary, they see how top watch my company is. Like, Holy shit, my eyes probably looks top notch. Yeah. And people are guaranteed going to be taking pictures of my lot and posting on on, on, on Twitter too. It's going to be trending, man. Oh my God, look at this beautiful lot. Nick, they, they, they post it, Nick Trends. Oh my God. I just and another own that. Yeah, they own, own all that, man. We're fucking boss. Damn, that's really nice. Sarah. 
a good like I don't know, 10 minutes I'm gonna go upstairs and eat my sausage. Get my sausage, so you'll see me eating when I make the video, obviously, because I bought hot dog bread, so I'm gonna eat my sausage with hot dog. That's my lunch pretty much. And tonight I'm gonna get get my pizza at uh Vincent's when I come home. Uh, yeah. And my deal for the Burgeon Dark Resort is Temple Woman also revealed. If you want more money, guys, I'm not paying you more money. If they're greedy, I can pay them 11.1, a bit more, but I'm not going any higher than them. If you want 20 million, you rip me off. For Tarantula Talk for two days, you rip me off. I'm not going to let you do it like that. I got to watch it for my budget. Temple Woman also is a good is a good deal. You can pocket your millions, but I want some of the money going towards my carpet, the two day party, all you can drink alcohol, the food, the feeding, buffet food. Yeah. You got to hire security guards for the event. I want barricades. I want to buy carpet. I want a red carpet starting inside the hotel and it leads outside. So the fans are inside, they're also outside. You have barricades, you have security guards. I want you to hire a good like 14, 15 photographers to take pictures of my three. For the red carpet event. In Hollywood, they have like 50 photographers. It's really fucking crazy. For my company, you have maybe 17 photographers that take the pictures. Of the actors feature and the crewmen feature. So all the actors are featured... With me, my seven other Peter, Fran, Guillermo del Toro, George Lucas, they're all featured there. Obviously. Barry Osborne, they're all featured there. My seven team are featured, obviously. Um the head chefs, I want them featured there too. You can have them featured. They're my main guys. My web designer, my graph designers, I want them featured. Obviously, the doctor will be filming it. Um Hans Zimmer, the costume designers. The main visual effects guys have them be featured. The main ones. So I'm saying the main makeup artists, the main hair designers are featured. Just just the supervisors, those guys are featured. So I'm saying the cinematographers, I want them featured too. The main six, whatever it is. The assistants, they don't have to be featured. But the main ones, you can have them be featured. Or you can have the assistants featured if you want. But for the for the other guys, the, 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 the like the other assistant chefs are not featured. Only the the, the, the the head chefs are featured. Like, the, the supervisors are featured. So you have a good, I don't know, maybe 60, 70 people featured on the red carpet. It's mean, crazy. Yeah. It's going fucking crazy, am I? Look at a beautiful event. Am I? I don't know, the red... The, the, the Zane's Red Carpet's trending, and while that's trending on, on, on Twitter, the Hollywood companies, are, some of the Hollywood movies are doing their Red Carpet, and all those actors and producers and all them play shit. Because <laughs> I've seen and this, and this movie's the main event, their they're Red Carpet's the side attention, and they're all tuning into the trends. Holy shit, that Red Carpet looks sick. Yeah, it's in Switzerland, in Lucerne, Switzerland, at the Bridge Art Resort. Yeah, it looks sick, obviously. Sick, yeah, but I don't know how to actually say, Oh, please, man, I'll be your next movie. I'm like, No, not your next movie, man. Oh, I, mean, I want to be in that secret agent movie with Keanu Reeves and Scott Johansson. And I'm like, Look, man, you're not good for the movie, okay? If they're good for the movie, you're not good for the movie. And it's not fair that you were safe for five years and they're, like, they're left behind in Hollywood for like shit. You need to give other actors an opportunity, it's not just about you guys. But they don't care, obviously, because they're what they're crazy people, obviously. They don't want to be left behind. And my company is like Incredibles. Like Hollywood's not like Incredibles. Hollywood is high end. It's high. It's high end, obviously. But it's not like Incredibles, man. Mine's like Incredibles, man. Yeah. It's nice to party up at a five hundred million dollar super advanced condo, man, and a high end like ninety million dollar yacht. Like that yacht I showed you. Yeah. The Hollywood producers don't own yachts like that and jets like that. They have maybe twenty eleven million dollar houses, but not like a five hundred dollar condo. They don't. The Hollywood studios, studio lot is not as nice as my lot. My lot's fucking nice. Yeah, man. Yeah. 
Is there? Yeah. And second year, Peter has something signed the four groups of crewmen, wetter workshop, mass designers, costume designers, and extra crewmen. I want to sign those guys first year. And second year, they have to start working immediately. Yeah, give them like two, two plus years, man. So to work on all that. In the early second year, the actors are flown in and Peter will help me sign the stars. I'm saying? I'll sign Avon Joje, John Baega, and uh, Jimon Su first because they're the supporting leads of the movie. And I signed the rest, obviously. Carl Urban, Don Cheadle, I'm saying. Ron and Grani, all those guys. Andy Circus, I'm saying. Yeah. Will it be excited? Yeah, they're going to be so excited. You're going to see how small they're They're fucking excited. I can't wait to be part of this movie, man. And they're filling on top of the world. Once they're signed, they're now a part of the glory. Because now everyone's tuning into their social media and they're trending too. Wherever they are, they're not trending now because they're part of this ain't movie. You get this casting announcement news on my Scarface news. I you, you get the cast announcement. He's playing the role of Tassetonius. John John Baiga is playing the role of Tassetonius. You know what I'm saying? And then like when Peter Jackson signed, you get the news that the, the Peter Jackson's the chosen director. You get a multiple the assistant director. Um. Fran and uh, and uh, Barry Osborne, assistant producers. Peter is executive producer. So Peter will be the executive producer, co-writer, and director for the movie. Get him all towards the uh, assistant co-writer, assistant director, and assistant producer. You see Fran's the assistant producer, assistant co-writer. You see what Barry Osborne's the assistant producer. You see what Yeah. You see I haven't hired his team. I hired my team after the movie. Yeah. The whole was going crazy reading the news. Obsessed with tweeting the news. Fuck, I wish I can cover this on my YouTube channel. I get so much views. Yeah, but <laughs> I didn't sell hands behind the scenes. And whose fault is that? It's your fault, man. I would have boosted your channel's views and everything, but you guys are fucking rabid people. You chose to keep behind the scenes, hence you get what you deserve. Give me a second, guys. I'm going to go just get my sauce. I'll be back in a little hate. So. <sighs>
I'm back guys. I want to just make my sausage. I'm having sausage. <coughs> sausage with hot dog bread and ketchup, mustard, and onions. You like sausage? I even know I love sausage. Sausage is amazing. I even want you to have hot dogs for the uh for, for, for the um for your for your buffet and sausage. I don't want to do that because if you have too much food, more of your food will go to waste. No, just sliders is enough. Hamburger sliders is enough. I'm not going to have hot dogs or sausage. I'll have sausage for breakfast, but not for the lunch. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah. Hence why what? I thought we talk not about Yemen. Some Sarah? Yeah. I'm drinking soy milk. Now this is gonna take my shower. Go to search my parents will enjoy show with you guys. Now I'll watch, I don't know. I don't wanna watch but And beware of the greedy Hollywood actors. If the Hollywood actors want more money, man, you have to be sure can say no. I'm sorry. Especially the big guys. Some big guys might try and push for $150, $200. I'm like, no, guys. I'm not paying you that royalty check. You're fucking crazy. You're not worth that. And they know it too. They know they're not worth my royalties. No. It's one thing for me to pay you 100, 125 million in royalties. It's another thing for me to pay you 150, 200 million in royalties when you're not worth that. The world's one crazy man because of me, mine's another. Not you. That's a lot of the Hollywood actors, Asians, do people, man. You might use that excuse, Ivan, it's nothing. I'm like, that's not the point, man. You're not worth that. I'm not paying you that, I'm sorry. This is your life, and yeah, give it a deal. Yeah. That sausage is pretty good. Pretty good sausage. Yeah, once you sign the Hollywood actors for Zanus, you take them out to my boss and pizza. Oh. 
Boston Pizza has good food, man. They have good food. I think it's the best restaurant chain in Canada, man. Or one of them, right? So it's one of the best restaurant chains in Canada. They have really good pizza. They have good burgers. They have wings. They have all that good stuff, yeah. Salad. Okay. And for the Great Escape, I'll do one at Montana's. My take also at Montana's. Montana's also has good food. They have good ribs there. Yeah. And once you, you, they, they eat with you at Boston Pizza, you pry it up at your condo for like six hours and you have a good time with them. You have a good time with the stars. And they're all going to post videos and pictures. Hey, I'm at a party right now. Hey, I'm pirated up at Ivan and living at his condo. You know, and they're all bragging. It. And then they post it. You guys are all tuning into their Twitter or Instagram. Yeah. You know, and you feel like total shit because you're like, oh, man, he's, all the hoverackers are envy the man. Those guys are fucking lucky, man. You're going to be a part of that amazing story. Everything and demons. We're all lucky behind Hollywood. Yeah. Fuck, man. Ivan's company looks much better than fucking Hollywood. Yeah, like, he has a high-end, like, high-end fucking place. Yeah, you're going to see my condo in the back when they, when they take the reels and pictures. Hey, I'm at a party right now. You see, like, Andy Circus, You see John Baega. You see Idris Elba. They post, they post reels and pictures. Hey, I'm at a party right now. I just signed my contract for the movie. You know what I'm saying? And all the Hollywood actors were, like, told shit. Yeah. Yeah, man. Sarah? <coughs> yeah. So once, yeah, once I sign the stars, a couple of days later, all the interviews will interview them, and then a couple of days later, you get this Sky Source um, announcement on my Sky Source news section of my website. It says the cast announcement, and they, you see all their like quick, like three minute interviews featured on there. And you fly them in, and they do their uh, their, their the magazine ad shit with you, obviously. You and your and your seven other and Peter, and it gets featured in Scott's News. Something top notch. These nice like magazine digital pictures, man. Something fucking nice. <laughs> yeah, professional shoot, man. Yeah, and I'll sponsor them with the clothes. For the shoot, obviously. Yeah. Nice high end clothes I'll sponsor them with for the, for, for the shoot. Someone's calling the house. I don't know who it is, but. Sarah? Yeah. This is an amazing yeah, man. Well, John Cappy and Rob maybe went crazy. Yeah. I don't know. They go crazy for movies like Deadpool, Ryan Reynolds' Deadpool. You know what I'm saying? They go crazy for King of the Apes. They go crazy for Avengers Infinity War. 
and yet Zayn's is going to blow that buzz out of the water. Whereby they're going crazy, man. They're like diehard fans. New Jews is going crazy, and he's a hardcore Star Wars fan. You know how New Jews goes crazy for the Star Wars movies? Yeah, imagine the Zayn's movie is going crazy for that, man, because it's me acting in the movie, right? I'm the prince. I assume others acting with Zithia, and, and, and they read my book. You're looking at an amazing movie. Eric, them are demons, man. They're devils. The devil thing of itself. <laughs> yeah. Or rated our crazy movie. Yeah. That's why the kids can't watch it, obviously. Yeah. They have to wait till they're older. The teens are going to watch it, obviously. The 13, 14 year olds will watch it. Their parents will be like, oh, just stay close to me, you know what I'm saying? But the little kids can't watch it, obviously. They have to wait till they're a little bit older. That's why Peter might tell me, Ivan, you got to think about the kids, man. I'm like, Peter, man, I don't want Zayn as PG-13, man. The movie won't be... It'll be a masterpiece, but it won't be as powerful of a story. Is Tactics and Agony for a PG-13 wolf or a radar wolf? No, I want him to be a devil. I don't know what I'm doing, man. I'm saying, huh? Yeah. Zayn I want it to be radar. I want it to be gory and everything. And that way you tell about what I know what I'm doing. I'm saying, huh? It says, I toned down the sex, obviously. The sex scenes, I'm going to tone it down. I'm not going to have it full news like Game of Thrones. That's crazy. No. Have it be like something like um, like Shogun. Shogun, they have sex in it, but it's like partial nudes. Something like that. Not full news like Game of Thrones. No. That's crazy. So I'm going to have it. 